Hey guys, welcome back to Crystal Bricks, and welcome to my 2020 studio tour. So as you may know from my previous videos, I will be moving very soon. So I decided to film a studio tour so I could compare it to the one in my new house. And I thought I think it would be really cool just if I need to see anything or some stuff that I did in the last studio for this for the next house. So the first thing I'm going to show is the city. You, there's many videos on this, so if you'd like to check them out, they'll probably be in the description. I'm not going to spend too much time on it, but here it is. It's in one corner of the basement. So the next thing I'd like to show is off first to the right of the LEGO City table, I keep my tripod, which is just one from Amazon. And then in these drawers, I keep many of my LEGO bricks. Also, beside the LEGO City on the right, I do keep the Detolf cabinet, which displays mostly minifigures for the time being, though there are architecture sets. So, so the next thing I'd like to show is under the table. This is where I keep most of my boxes and a lot of Lego pieces. It's almost filled up, so in the new house there will be more room for that. But it is just very basic, not much to it. And then above where the boxes are in the left of the city, there is one table that I use for building, but that usually doesn't happen since there's so much stuff on it. I keep most of my drawers of Lego and other stuff that is just not stored in other places. And that's really it for the basement where I keep the Lego City and that stuff. The next thing I will be looking at is my room. This is where I keep lots of Lego, which is mostly my Star Wars collection and my Ninjago collection. So as you walk in, you can see a white drawer, which does include all my Lego Ninjago sets, which I am planning on destroying for the new, for the new next house. I just feel like I don't really use them, and I don't really even enjoy enjoy them. The next thing I'd like to show is is my Star Wars collection. So as you can see, there's three different levels to the collection. So the first level of the collection is some of my biggest and favorite sets. These include the Millennium Falcon, the Star Destroyer and the Death Star along with a snow speeder. Now moving on to the next level. This is my some of my least favorite sets. These are still Star Wars though and this is really all, all there is. And then then we go to the third level. These are some of my favorite sets again. So that's all for the Lego Star Wars collection. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. I hope you enjoyed the studio tour and I hope to see you in the next one.